The microscope as we know it has been around for several hundred years and the EM1 is really the first time there's been a major rethink into the way it's designed and used. This is a revolutionary product. One of the things that struck me when I first encountered the microscope was how good it was as a device in its own right. But then my mind was literally blown when I saw that you could attach a smartphone to it using one of our adapters. And it changes the game entirely then because it means that a microscope that's usually based on a bench can be transported anywhere in the world. The amazing thing about the M1 is that it combines robustness, weight, an amazing equation on cost and novel optics manufactured to ISO 9000 standards. And that, combined with the ability to interface with smartphones, takes this really down a very novel journey. My name is Sally. I'm a research scientist. I work mainly on microscopic organisms. I first came across the EM1 when I was looking for a microscope that I could use as a research scientist, but also one that I could recommend to educators and community groups and interested amateurs who are all looking for a microscope that was affordable, but also high quality. Obviously the best thing about the EM1 is that it's extremely portable. But not only is this microscope portable, it actually does almost everything I need a bright field microscope to do. I can use it in my hand or I can mount it on a tripod which makes it even easier to use. It has three objectives, a 10x eyepiece, it has a mechanical stage, a focus ring, a small LED illuminator. I can connect the microscope to a phone through a phone adapter and instantly take videos or pictures of the organisms that I'm looking at. I can even airplay my phone to a a screen or to a projector and then get a really big image showing the microbes that I'm looking at under the microscope. In terms of prototypes we've got uh, microscopes in more than 30 countries, 38 I think at the last count. Uh, they're being used for a whole range of uses. It may be the EM1 being used in a refugee camp where water sanitation may be of very poor quality. Another of our microscopes is used in the gorilla sanctuary for disease diagnosis and the feedback that we've got has been absolutely astounding. It doesn't matter what environment you're in, but the M1 has a use and an application. I see it as a product that can change lives. Just one might be malaria because of the misdiagnosis in the field at the point of, of contact. As someone who's constantly trying to connect people to the microbes that are all around them, the fact that I can take this microscope to the location, look at a sample from that location on site, and then instantly beam those images and videos is an extremely important tool for my work. So what we have here is a very powerful microscope that will perform every bit as well as a conventional bench laboratory microscope for rather less money and much, much less weight and bulk. Just imagine being able to attach a smartphone to the M1 and have applications that we build, not only to allow you to see what's on the microscope, but also identify it as well. And we're looking to use and have started the journey of using artificial intelligence and machine learning. You see, for most of its past history, um, a microscope sits on a laboratory bench and you take the specimen to the microscope. Once you've got a powerful instrument like this that you can put in your pocket and take out into the field, then you're taking the microscope to the subject. This is what makes the EM1 so revolutionary.